everybody, today I am going to do a boohoo clothing haul. So if clothes are not your thing, then this video will be really boring. But if you are like me and you are a bit of a shopaholic and you love clothes, then you are going to love it. I'm gonna get straight into it because I got quite a few things and also I'm really sorry if my fringe irritates the heck out of you through this video. It's irritating the heck out of me. If any of you follow me on Twitter the other day I said I want to chop my hair off. I know it's a very big statement to make but just I'm just so bored of it and it just is so long it just like sticks to my head like this when it's freshly washed and it's just it's a nightmare. Look at it. Ah. I might actually have to pin it. Problem solved for now. Okay, so where to begin? Now there's a very apparent colour scheme through this. I know I always go for the blacks and the whites and the monochrome. I've also gone for some kind of more kind of wintry shades such as the navy velvet and the aubergine colour. But besides that, it's all quite monochrome. I'm so bad with monochrome things. Like I just live in black and white. Like I'm wearing white today. Apart from my joggers, which happen to be very sexy, um, I just live in black and white. So this first thing I picked up is a play suit and it's black and it has lace stars around the boobage area and it has a crossover back. Now I think this is probably a no bra wearing um, thing and I would say this would be awesome for a Christmas party. That's what I have in mind for it anyway and for those of you that are feeling quite brave with the whole no bra thing, um, I just think it would look awesome because the back is so exposed um, and you could just buy some of that boob tape, you know the stuff that sticks bits down? The boob tape, just get some of that and you should be fine. I really like them stars. Next thing is another play suit. I'm clearly loving play suits right now. Play suit season. Um, and it is this one, it just has like striped mesh at the top um, and then just goes down into a simple play suit but I liked that one too and again it's black. Oh this next thing I picked up, um, I was feeling quite like brave and it looked awesome on the model and I was like I wonder if I can pull this off. So it's this metallic top. Now I love this, obviously I've just got it straight out of the packaging so it's got like this awful like crease on it so I will have to give that a good iron before I actually properly wear it. But I was thinking like these, th these, this would look really really nice with like black trousers or disco pants, something like that. I just really like it. I love the metallicness, especially around Christmas time and to kind of go with this I picked up these which I really like. I don't know if I can pull them off in the slightest, but they are like pleather trousers. One of my friends had a pair of leather trousers on the other day. Lucy, if you're watching this, I'm talking about you. Um, and she was rocking them and I absolutely loved them on her. And she was like, I just wear them with everything. Like slouchy tops, which obviously I wear quite a lot of the time. Um, something glitzy. Um, and I just don't own anything in this sort of material. Obviously it's not real leather, it's just pleather, plastic leather. I think I just spat when I said that. Pleather. I really liked them. They've got zippy pockets here and like what I like to call, um, not armadillo, yeah, chucky pig. <laughs> what do you guys call chucky pigs? Because here in the UK, I think we all call them the same thing. It's those little like woodlouse. Okay, maybe we don't all call them chucky pigs. Maybe that's just me. And they also have the chucky pig part here, which is just like the lower part of the trousers. But I just thought the two together would look awesome. So I'm going to give them a try, but if I can't pull them off like Lucy, I'm going to be very sad. I also picked up this pair of trousers, um, which are kind of like trousers slash leggings. Um, I have a few pairs of these. I'm like a bit obsessed with them because they're super comfy and I feel like they can just go with everything. Like this would go with like the top I'm wearing right now, for example, instead of these if I wanted to be a little bit more stylish. Um, and I just really liked the kind of crosses on there. I thought they looked really cool. And that could also be one with the metallic top, actually. There you go. Some nice heels. But yeah, I really like these. They feel really nice and cosy and comfy. And they have pockets. So that's like a huge added bonus. 
So I think I got a little bit carried away when it came to the velvet swing dresses. I love swing dresses. I feel like they really suit my shape as they kind of go in and then float out and they were long sleeved as well which is harder to find around this time of the year but I do love a long sleeve dress and um, they had them in a few colours so I have gone for a navy blue one I just think these are so lovely with a pair of black tights and boots navy blue I don't wear navy blue enough you know I feel like I should because I have blue eyes and they do say that if you have blue eyes you should wear blue clothes and it makes your eyes stand out um, but I don't know how true that is but still I really love this colour and I think it I think this is really Christmassy not as Christmassy though as this colour ultimate Christmas shape this is so soft I could literally just oh my goodness you know how I feel about blankets and soft things it's lovely really lovely and the quality feels really nice as well um, so I think I'll probably get good wear out of those and because you know I love the monochrome I did pick up a black one as well I think this next thing is possibly my favourite I have three favourites and this is one of them um, it's this dress which I absolutely love it has short cat sleeves it has this beautiful black and white kind of paisley print and it flares out into this really cute shape I just really like this I love this style of dress um, really high neck um, and I don't know I just instantly fell in love with this one this one I was feeling brave about and I'm not sure I'm gonna be able to pull this off but I really hope I can and it is a maroon or berry colored jumpsuit which starts off like shirt style I can't even begin to tell you how soft this feels this is like nothing I've ever felt before it almost feels like the velvet um, and then you've got kind of place for a belt here and then it goes into trousers now I love play suits and jumpsuits play suits I find are a lot easier to wear jumpsuits you've got the whole is this gonna fit me around the waist and be the right leg length is this gonna cut off at my ankles and make me look a bit short or is this gonna I don't know you've always got that added it needs to fit me around here 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 and be the right length whereas with a play suit as long as it's covering your bottom you're all good I'm excited to try this I'm a bit worried that I'm gonna look like someone in prison <laughs> like wearing like a prison jumpsuit or something but um, hopefully I can pull it off oh look at that it unbuttons all the way down to the front not that that really is very helpful for a woman when wearing a play suit uh, for a man maybe a little hole but uh, yeah <laughs> kind of going off topic slightly now on to accessories this is up there with one of my favorite things also and it is a hat I'm gonna put it on and show you it because I absolutely love it okay I'm gonna scooch down if I can look at it I love this hat it's so cozy and it fits my head let's take the tag off I almost want to wear this for the rest of the video this is perfect I'm gonna be living in this all of winter I can tell you now if you saw my pumpkin video then you will know my friend Gabby and a lot of her necklaces come from boohoo so I checked out the necklace section and I picked this up because I feel like I have a distinct lack of statement jewellery I have a few things but they're either very very colourful so they don't necessarily go with everything or they're really delicate um, so I picked this up and I really like it it's like proper costume jewellery but I also feel like it's not as big and as statement as some statement necklaces can be that would look really nice with the um, metallic top actually and lastly the thing that I also love that was in my top three um, are these little booties um, as it gets to the colder months dro dropping them on the floor um, obviously you're gonna kind of end up living in boots I know I do um, and these are the sorts of kind of comfy boots that you can just sling on with any outfit and they also have the little um, gaps in them so you can wear cute socks like the cute frilly ones or ones with guinea pigs on or pugs or whatever other kind of cute socks that you want to wear or tights even or tights with socks on top there's nothing wrong with that so I, I love that little cutout section where you can see through and they're flat well pretty much yeah 
that's not much of a heel on that, is it? They're flat um, and just amazing to throw on. I don't have many uh, flat boots. In fact, I have one pair of flat boots that I wear all the time and they're starting to, I've got something, on my, I've got some hair on my lip. They're starting to deteriorate and they're getting very, very muddy. So I feel like this is a nice step up and they look really pretty. And that is everything from Boohoo that I wanted to share with you. Boohoo are actually holding a competition for you guys to win everything that I just showed in this haul. I know, it's really nice of them, like, super nice. So if you want to enter that, all the details will be in the description box and you can click the link and go through. I would do it because it's free for you to do it and why not? Plus there are some amazing things there if I say so myself. Let me know what your autumn and winter staples are and let me know if you've managed to find yourself a bubble hat that's as amazing as this one. And I will see you again next week.